citizens in their own right. They deserve recognition and respect to make sense of the world they live in. Citizens who need a voice so they can play a part in shaping the future. There may well be differences in what youth means across borders, across cultures and across economies. But the youth agenda should be at the heart and not at the margins of society. Budapest and the European Youth Centre. The scene is set for the residential element of a short course, itself part of a two-year project funded by the European Commission's lifelong learning programme. The course involves academics, people who work in youth policy and those working directly with young people across Europe. A course to pave the way for a pioneering project that challenges our traditional approaches to learning. But first, the barriers must come down. You're on the outside, it's the wrong place to go. Oh, to come in here. <laughs> you can feel important tomorrow morning, but not right now. You what just have pity. to swing yourself over here or walk round and through yeah, the gap. I, I... It's a unique opportunity to meet and share experiences. Nothing like this has been done before. It's not surprising then that the short course has attracted highly motivated participants with a wide range of experience. We were very impressed with the, the calibre of the, 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 the applications we received. We wanted to ensure things like, um, like gender, uh, culture, location, that, that sort of stuff that gives the group a nice flavour. I know what my thoughts are, but I don't know <laughs> exactly. yours. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Many participants okay, will go on to enrol in the two-year MA programme, a programme that will champion the highest academic endeavour, a gold standard for others to follow. Whereas we did have some Both this short course and the MA EYS are based on key philosophies. The first, that the areas of research, policy and practice in youth studies must exist in partnership to reflect our rapidly changing society. One of the things about the MAUS is to try to make the dialogue and the interchange better between the three corners of our triangle, which are research, policy and practice. The people who work in these three corners uh, live in different kinds of worlds, of thinking and also of action. They don't really understand the logic of each other's work. And if you're thinking about the future and you're thinking about a research that makes sense to the sector, you're thinking about a practice which is reflected and a policy which is responsive, then you need to make more interaction between the three corners. And the only way of doing that is to bring the three corners together, and that's what we do. This week is one of those points at which lots of trajectories coalesce together. So we are bring diversity into a room together. Gençlik çalışmalarının içinde farklı yollarla yine aynı şekilde gençliğe yardım etme ve gençlik için bir şeyler yapma e, söz konusu ve bununla ilgili hem bir pratisyen olarak e, farklı şekillerde yaparken araştırmacı ve politika yapıcı olarak e, bunu farklı yöntemlerle yapıyor olmak ve bu yöntemleri buradaki insanlarla konuşuyor ve öğreniyor olmak gençlik çalışmaları adına benim için çok büyük bir kazanç. С тази магистрска програма ние се опитваме да създадем една нова територия, в която изследванията, работата с младежта и политиката се обединяват и обогатяват една след друга. The driving force behind the youth studies program is a consortium of university partners. Now we are entering according to some Once completed, the MA will be a genuinely European level qualification, recognized across borders and across disciplines a gateway to further academic study at PhD level, or one which will enrich the professional lives of participants and those they work with. What came up today that made you perhaps question some of your own findings from the case studies? Another key philosophy is the way the MAEYS programme will be delivered. A groundbreaking combination of residential seminars, period studying at one of several universities in Europe, and online learning and support. Andreas Karsten is an education consultant specializing in online learning. He's developing the MAEYS online platform, enabling future participants to learn at their own pace, supported by a network of tutors. What we have done is we have built basically a social network 
and transform that into a learning environment, which is pretty exciting for us because as far as we know, nobody has quite tried that yet before. Every student has their own portfolio, which they use to produce pieces that will be assessed. And we have a help page that helps students who have trouble navigating the site once in a while. And this new way of learning has created not just a virtual community, but a real shared experience. It's an experience fantastic. I'm learning a lot because really, Tot i que ara estem al seminari residencial, estem tots junts, ens veiem cara a cara, en veritat el curs, tot el curs té lloc en un espai virtual. És un curs virtual i per tant és una experiència única. Estem en contacte i al mateix temps estem a casa nostra amb les nostres realitats. Per tant és una experiència única, estic aprenent moltíssim. La tercera filosofia és de combinar diferents aproves a l'aprenent. We try to link these three kinds of learning together, which are very well known now, formal, non-formal and informal. It's what I call the learning continuum. Uh, it's not so important uh, where you place a particular kind of teaching and learning. It's important that you mix and match different parts of it so that everybody has the sense that there is some kind of method to which they can engage well. A central component of the MA programme is seeing how theory and policy is put into practice. In Budapest, participants on the short course have visited youth projects, like this one in the city's 7th district. And here, there is a district, the smallest district of Budapest, the 7th. It's a chance to experience youth realities on the ground. We provide information service in any topic, like uh, all youngsters can come with any kind of problems and we try to deal with it. My first question would be, who pays the fees? We don't pay anything for it. They are just super nice guys running this bar and telling that society and these things are important for us, so we provide this space for you. This is very small and that's why I cannot ask for more, because I don't pay for it. We would like to present our um, uh, field visit. It was at the Cherry uh, Youth Center, Cherishnie, and uh, we follow the graphical approach that um, Zora, the director of the center, used. Viviamo in un mondo che è radicalmente diverso da quello di 20 o 50 anni fa e in fondo i processi di innovazione hanno uh, radicalmente cambiato il nostro modo di vivere e di comunicare e Forse dovrebbero, dovremmo noi cambiare anche il nostro modo di insegnare, il, nostro, il modo di costruire conoscenza e costruire processi educativi. E in qualche modo le università stentano ancora a fare i conti con questa trasformazione. Invece la sfida che il, il progetto di una laurea magistrale in European Youth Studies sta cercando di costruire è proprio quella di fare i conti sino in fondo con questa trasformazione costruendo ponti tra istituzioni universitarie, tra culture, lingue, giovani provenienti da tutta Europa. E in fondo quella che è la sfida futura per le università europee. In qualche modo io ritengo che la laurea magistrale in European Youth Studies, questa sia già il presente in qualche modo, è già il presente di un processo che è in atto e che per l'università europea sarà il futuro. Jaučiuosi į, į galintą ir į kvėptą. Į galintą dirbti jaunimo srityje kitam lygmenį, efektyviau, kokį biškiau. Ir šitas seminaras Budapeštė yra nei kaino mes įkvėpimas, nes aš mokusi kartu su ir iš nuostabų žmonių. I want you to watch what's happening. It's not going to take very long. The short course is coming to a close. The next challenge, the introduction of the MAEYS across Europe. It's an opportunity that mustn't be missed. We all have a stake in it. You know, the reason this thing is as important as it is, is not only because it's the first time that something like this has been done in the way it's been done. But the reason it's important is because we have to make the ways in which our education systems don't work for young people, work better for young people. Because young people, if they're not at the 
forefront of our thinking and our action for the future of our society, then none of us are going anywhere.